One of those nurses is Mary Shaughnessy Swisher, and she joins us now. Good morning, Mary. Good morning. So what is it, um, what's your role right now? Uh, we're just trying to facilitate um, people uh, coming in and uh, making sure they go through the process to get their vaccines. Okay. And then we watch, watch them after they get the vaccine to make sure that they aren't having any side effects that, that might come up. And what has and, uh, your time been like volunteering during the pandemic? It's really been fun. Um, since, since I've worked at Mercy, we have um, had all kinds of nurses from the past that have been coming through. And uh, it's been like a little reunion. And uh, we've had lots of laughs and catch-ups. And uh, it's, it's been really fun. What was it like prior to you coming back? I mean, when you were at home watching what was going on, you know, was it hard for you to not want to help? Yes. Yeah. Seeing uh, that the virus unfold and um, seeing all the horrible deaths uh, that are occurring, you feel like as a nurse, you just really do want to help. And I think it's just bred into us. Mm -hmm. So, um, this, this was an opportunity to, to help. And uh, I'm so glad I participated. Now, Mary, have you been vaccinated and what was your experience? Yes, I've had the first vaccine and um, uh, nothing. I didn't have any problems at all. It was, there was a little stinging when I had it and then uh, I had no, nothing from there on. No. I didn't get the soreness that a lot of people get and I felt Perfectly fine. Yeah. And um, do you have a sense of relief now that you've gotten a vaccine? Well, I uh, was very happy to get it, and I still need to get the second one. Uh, but you can't let your guard down. We have to wait till our immunity picks up and um, making sure that we continue face masks and social distancing and uh, hand washing, you know, like everybody knows. Uh, but yeah, it's a, it's a relief just to have gotten it started, and I'm so thankful that we did get that. And Mary, um, how long are you planning to volunteer? Well, um, I will volunteer till we get uh, the staff vaccinated here, and then um, we're looking into other avenues that um, we can provide some services to. We I don't think we're done yet. Yeah, I mean, got a, for a group of gals and right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Mary, did you ever think you were going to have to come out of retirement? I mean, it's you think you retire and you're done and you're just going to maybe go on a vacation. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, really. No, I didn't. And uh, in the back of my mind, maybe at some point I might be able to retire. I still have my license current, but uh, yeah, it's 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 really wonderful. Good. Well, thank you so much, Mary, for joining us this morning. You're welcome. Thank you. Well, CHI Health is always looking for volunteers. If you're interested, you can find more information on their website. Just go to chihealth.com and search volunteer services.